All right, today we're going to be looking at this uh, General Electric digital alarm clock that I found at a thrift store. You know, I, I don't really buy clocks like this, but this one interested me because the buttons are on, like, the side here. Let's see if this phone will want to focus. Focus. Okay, it doesn't want to focus. But, um... This clock intrigued me. Well, not really intrigued me, but it interested me because all the buttons are on the side here. You can see. Now, there are some knobs here to turn the clock to AM and PM. Here's your turning. And then here's the um, or AM and FM. Sorry, not PM. Um... Here's your volume switch. It's this knob right here. And uh, this clock does something interesting. When you hold down the snooze button, it shows you the um, the minute you're on, as you can see, five, and then the seconds. I've only seen digital alarm clocks show the seconds. I've never seen it done do this. So that's interesting. Um, so here's a knob here to, to turn the alarm on and off, as you can see, wake two, here's wake one, and, um, here's how you set the time, the switch here, and to turn the, uh, radio on, you just gotta do that, for the little pop, turn the knob up. Oh god, yeah, copyright. Um, but uh, yeah, the, it actually has a decent speaker on it. Here's the bottom side of it. It actually, surprisingly enough, it does have a Duracell battery in it. But I think the battery is dead. Because I actually put in, I actually tried putting it back in. So here's how you set the time. If I were to press these buttons, let me just make sure it's not on set. If I were to press these buttons, nothing would happen. But if it was on, it, but if I flick that switch there, I could actually set the time. This one actually has a fast forward. And here's sleep. I don't know what it does. Um, here's your wake, you have music, alarm, and set. So you can set the alarms, this one has the same. Turn it off. But yeah, here's the snooze button. Which is just snooze. You can see the spelling a little bit. It's just snooze. I think the E got scratched off or something. As you can see, the radio is actually pretty big. The, no, they're not the radio. The, uh, the speaker. Sorry. You kind of see the back. It's got nothing on the back. It's got no antenna, though. I, I actually looked. There's no antenna. can kind of see the electrics. It's the date code. Does that say 2001? Oh yeah, that's, this was made in 2001. Oh my god. Who oh. Turn wake one on. Let's see if there's any more features. So yeah, there's the tuning. I'll show what it sounds like on AM, because I don't think there's any copyrighted music on AM. Let me just flick the switch. And... Time Conditions. Well, what would be the benefit of that radio? Well, the question that plagues many people. Chick isn't working <laughs> after the effects of the... Yeah. 
I don't know what half the stuff on there is. But, um, yeah, I apologize for the angle there. It's just hard navigating this. But, um, yeah, it, it's on accurate time, too. You're about to hear these two go off. Uh, <laughs> it's on accurate time, too. Um, I don't know how long I had this. As you can see there, it says battery backup. It also has a battery backup, too. I look here, and it says battery backup. So I guess that's what the battery is. Um, whoa, see? It's on accurate time. But that's... Um, it has battery backup. There's the General Electric logo. Um... Yeah, nothing really too, too special about this one. <coughs> Sorry. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Thank you for watching, and bye.